What is going on guys, welcome back to another mod review and today we are going to be reviewing the mod called the Better Grass and Leaves mod. Now as you can see right now my Minecraft looks a slight bit different and essentially what this mod does, it does what the title says, it adds better grass and leaves to the game. Um, this mod is not compatible with all texture packs and it does look a bit weird on other texture packs, you guys know I use Sawtech texture pack but I tried it on there, it looks a, bit, a little bit weird but if you use default texture pack and you can actually see what it does to default texture pack right here. It just adds really nice textures to the leaves and the grass. And I'll show you how it's done it. But let me walk around and show you all the new textures. Now, when you see all these kind of grass blocks, every single grass block now has this kind of like miniature grass on it. It looks similar to long grass. Like right there, that's long grass. But this is the new grass which it adds in this mod. And it's on every single grass block. So if you go on a field or something like that, it actually looks really, really cool. Like here, you can actually see it here. It's like all over this. This is some long grass. But here is the grass that came with the mod. So this is the better grass. And one and one thing this grass does is when you like, if I go F5, you can actually see the grass actually moves when I walk in it. It's a really, really cool feature. So as you're walking along, the grass actually has a little animation to it. So you can actually see a trail of where you're walking, which is really, really cool. Um, and let me show you the leaves as well. Uh, let me go over here and I'll show you an example of how the leaves look. Now, as you can see, the trees slightly look a little bit different. And they look more rounded. And in my opinion, they look a lot, lot better, especially with the bushes and stuff. They just look more realistic because trees... Oh, are rounded and everyone knows Minecraft is squares but I don't know I, I just like this I think it looks more just just more realistic adds more detail more definition especially to the big trees look how awesome that big tree looks just because of this new leaf texture let me click on it and I'll show you what it actually looks like I'll have to place it on this grass down here so if I place it down you'll see that the leaf block is still there essentially but it's just got this kind of like funny circular shape in the middle of it and it kind of looks weird when you place one on its own like that but when you start putting them together they start actually merging together and actually looking really good as kind of like a hedge or a bush or something and as you can see as i got on my house here i've got the bushes all the way around and it just looks really good it just adds more detail to the game and i really really do love this mod i only found about out about it quite recently but when I found it, it just, it's just really awesome. I loved it. And it kind of adds this kind of like side grass as well. So if you're not using Optifine or anything like that, you can just add this mod to the game and it looks really good. Um, another thing that this mod adds, it adds sea plants. It's kind of, I think it's called seaweed in the game. I'm not 100% sure. I think I'll find that in the options, but I'll show you it if I can go over here you can see some over there it adds randomly generated seaweed to the game which i think looks awesome and i think could be something that added to could be added to normal minecraft and you can get materials from it but as you can see there they just randomly spawn in and they just add so much to the water i really really like them and i'm not a big lover of default texture pack but if i started to use it again i'd definitely use this mod because i think it adds a lot to the game um, what other features this mod had? Oh, it has a really cool feature where trees now have an effect where they drop leaves off the tree. So we'll have we'll stand under this tree for a minute, and there you go. All the trees have this little like dropping leaves effect, which is really really cool. Really love it. Looks kind of like they're floating in the wind and drop dropping down to the bottom. It looks really good. Um, one thing about this mod, as you can see, it adds a lot of realism to the game. But what I think it looks much better with is if you use shaders mod with this mod as well because it is compatible with shaders and it just makes the game look really awesome so let's put shaders mod on right now and we will see what it actually looks like so if i go to shaders and let me put this one on and if we go here and we can actually see what this mod looks like and it just adds so much realism to the game now because we've got our real shadows we've got the trees looking real just look at that that looks amazing it looks so much like a real tree it's just crazy and if we go to the water over here we can see the new plants the seaweed that's in the water with the shaders mod it just looks really really good let's look at that you can actually have the reflection of the seaweed in the water there it's just amazing this uh with this mix with the shaders mod i just think it's so awesome i can't get enough of it i could honestly just walk around this map just like this just looking at everything and how good it all looks now got little bits of grass here just just uh coming off the grass there but every grass block has a bit of grass attached to it so for example if i just place this down here you'll see like the grass is on top there 
so it looks really good but let me show you a few features about this mod and what you can do because I think this mod does actually affect your FPS slightly so if you're getting any lag and you want to turn this off you can press F9 and it will turn off the grass uh, all the better grass and stuff so as you can see all these pieces of grass have gone and the trees are back to the normal square shape and you get, here you can see like all these big trees around here are just normal Minecraft shape now and if I toggle it back on and I press F9 it will just render them back in and as you can see the awesome trees I love the big trees in this mod it just looks amazing um, so if you want to go to the settings of the mod and customize anything you press F10 so when you press F10 it takes you to all the settings it's got all these settings that you can just mess around with you can turn the grass off and on if you don't like it you can have the leaves off and on if you don't like it so say you just like the leaves only and you don't like how the grass looks you can just turn it off and you can just have the grass and no just get rid of the grass and just have the leaves on its own or the other way around it's totally up to you you can change the the grass renderer ex experimental standard I don't know what that is yet you just have to mess around with it the rounded leads on and off it's all these different settings like you could just go through it guys and just mess around with it and see what you think it is really really in depth and the customization of it you can adjust how often you want the leaves to fall from the trees and stuff like that it's just so in depth this mod is really really awesome and I love it, I really do, it's one of my favourite mods and I think I'm going to start using it all the time now, just look at that, the way the leaves fall from the tree is honestly amazing. And mixed with the shaders, I just, I think after I finish this video I'm just going to still be walking around this and just looking at all of this because it just looks crazy, just look at that. Mixed with shaders and you've got better leaves and better grass, it looks crazy and are the weaves, leaves blowing in the wind? Yeah they are, they're waving up there. So it's crazy, really, really do love this mod. Um, if you want to try this mod out, guys, the link to the mod will be in the description. It is really easy to install. You can install it um, the same sort of way that I did in my how to install mods videos. You just use Magic Launcher, add it to your mods folder, and it is installed and it's easy to go. It's pretty much compatible with any uh, mod it's it, it doesn't run into any issues with any other mods. It's because it's a client side mod, so it doesn't affect the game. As a sense it just affects your side of the game so if I went onto a server it would still work but no one else would see it on the server just just only you if you know what I mean but yeah guys this mod is amazing and it makes Minecraft look so realistic I just can't get enough of these views around here especially with the shaders mod oh can't even get on the bush but yeah guys if you like this mod go and try it out link will be in the description to where you can get this mod and a link will be to in the description how to install mods on your minecraft but yeah guys let me know what you think of the mod and try it out but i hope you enjoyed this mod review and i will see you again in another video